Before we start composting, you will need to understand carbon and nitrogen and how to balance them in a compost pile. The ideal ratio of carbon to nitrogen when composting is between 25 to 30 parts carbon to one part nitrogen. Carbon sources include wood chips, hay, untreated sawdust, mulch, and dry leaves. Nitrogen sources include animal manure, food scraps, urine, fertilizers, and fresh cut grass. By itself, horse manure is close to the ideal carbon and nitrogen ratio and moisture level for composting. However, horse owners usually remove bedding along with the manure when cleaning stalls. Bedding primarily contributes carbon to the compost pile, which can offset the amount of nitrogen provided by the manure. The more bedding mixed with the manure, the more nitrogen you will need to add. Nitrogen should be added when the bedding and manure are being dumped in the compost bin or when the pile is being turned. Composting microbes need oxygen to survive, so it is a good idea to add an aeration tube to the pile as the pile is being built. The air tube should be added horizontally for every six inches of compost. A four inch piece of drain tube or PVC tube with holes drilled into it can be added. The compost should have water added to it until it has the feel of a fresh wrung out sponge but when squeezed, water should not drip out. Compost piles should be built up to at least a cubic yard in volume, three feet wide, three feet tall, and three feet long, and left to sit for about a week before turning the pile into the next bin.